Welcome back to the channel, it's Gaz here. I hope you're all having a fantastic day today. As you've seen from the title, as you've seen from the thumbnail, we have seven huge Call of Duty 2022 leagues to bring you today. But before we get into that, if you're new around here, make sure you hit that subscribe button with a bell notification turned on so you never miss a video on this channel. So what we're going to do right now is cut all the BS out and get straight into the leaks. So the first thing going into is that Call of Duty 2022, which I'm in this video I'm going to refer to as Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. The movement in that game is actually faster than Modern Warfare 2019, but it is slower than Call of Duty Vanguard. Take that as you wish, because what the second leak is kind of works really, really well with this movement change. So obviously, with a faster movement, how is the time to kill going to be changing? And I can tell you right now, the time to kill is actually slower than Vanguard. So with the increased movement speed of Modern Warfare 2019 and the slower time to kill, they kind of balance out very, very well and it kind of makes it very fair. And the next thing that is very fair is taking Call of Duty right back to the beginning of the minimap, the classic minimap. Everybody wants to be known what is going on with the minimap because Modern Warfare 2019, that started off as a bit of a mess, kind of ended as a bit of a mess and we kind of don't really talk about that. But Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 minimap is going to be returning to the classic minimap. That means when an enemy fires, that red dot is going to be showing on the minimap. So that's something awesome that we've wanted to see for quite a while now. And it's finally coming back. So now we have the classic minimap coming back once again. So if we look back to Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019, that was the first game that introduced the open and close doors. And they were kind of annoying and they kind of didn't really fit the game very well. But what I can say is, the doors are returning in Modern Warfare 2. The doors are going to be slightly changed, just slightly, but there's going to be less of the doors compared to Modern Warfare 2019. So there is doors, the doors are changed quite a bit, and there's, there's less of them. So it doesn't really matter because there's going to be less doors, so hopefully there won't be as much camping as we've seen previously. So at the moment we have three confirmed kill streaks. And they are the classic UAV, the chopper gunner, and the third one is actually a new one that we haven't seen before. And the name of it is, it's in the work, this could be the final one, this could just be the placeholder, but it is known as the sound wave. So you're probably wondering what is a sound wave? Well, from what we know so far, it's like an EMP, but for sound. So you're either going to be getting muffled sound, no sound, or just a whole range of sound that you don't really want to be hearing. Call of Duty Vanguard introduced something called combat pacing and this kind of changed how the game played so you either play very slow, very tactical, very campy or you play that high fast mode that everybody seems to kind of love right now and that combat pacing is actually going to be returning into Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 so that returns once again, that was a brand new feature in Call of Duty Vanguard and it's going to be returning once again in Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and the final one on this list is skill based matchmaking obviously this is a very controversial one people like it people don't like it but in the grand scheme of things it's a bit too harsh with what we're seeing right now especially in warzone right now it's currently too harsh we just need to tone it down a little bit and hopefully we'll get a nice free flowing game but what we do know so far for the skill based matchmaking is the games will still disband that means you won't be linked up with the people that you just played in the previous match because after every single game the the, uh, the lobby will disband and the game is going to be basically calculating your skill so it matches you with players of the same kind of skill or around about i don't really know how the skill based matchmaking is going to be going ahead just yet but obviously that is something that they tweak all the time and hopefully they get it right in call of duty modern warfare 2. So just like I said at the beginning of this video, hit that subscribe button if you're new around here with that bell notification turned on so you never miss a Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 video on this channel. So that is all the Call of Duty leaks that we have so far. Just like I said, hit up that like button and leave all your thoughts down in the comment section below. And hopefully we'll be getting some more videos just like this in the near future. So hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, leave all your thoughts down in the comment section below. And we will see you all in the next video. So thanks for watching, guys. 
and I'm out. Peace.